Like a lot of people hoping to cash in on the legalization of marijuana, a Toronto company called Alifia wants to connect patients with medical pot. Now, I was surprised to learn that Alifia is headed up by former Toronto police chief and former conservative cabinet minister Julian Fantino. This is a man who once tweeted, I am completely opposed to the legalization of marijuana and legalization only puts drugs on the streets. Now you want us to buy pot from you? Julian, are you high? <laughs> At one point, he even compared legalizing weed to legalizing murder. So keep your eyes peeled for the grand opening of his next business, Julian Fantino's Murder Hut. <laughs> wow. For someone who claims to have never smoked pot, Julian Fantino has a terrible memory. <laughs> but we don't. The last thing that Fantino was pushing was anti-weed legislation that put Canadians in jail, and now he wants to be your dealer. That's like if Robin Hood had an offshore tax haven in the Cayman Islands. <laughs> buying pot from Julian Fantino is like buying a sealskin coat from Pamela Anderson. <laughs> Fantino claims to have had a change of heart since embarking on a fact-finding mission about pot. Now, the only fact he found is that people are gonna pay a lot of money for marijuana. <laughs> Fantino is gonna make money selling the very thing that he arrested people for and campaigned against as an MP. This may seem hypocritical, but it's not. Julian Fantino has never wavered from his true belief that Julian Fantino should make money no matter what <laughs> Julian Fantino needs to say or do to make that money. In defense of himself, Fantino said, you will never be able to take away my integrity with respect to what I'm doing now and what I've done in the past. That's true, because like a stoner looking for a cookie he forgot he already ate, <laughs> you can't take something that isn't there. <laughs> Laughter is part of a well-balanced diet. Don't forget to subscribe to 22 Minutes Below so we can do this again soon.